Hey, what's up, guys? I am back, and we are doing all Tool songs from the beginning to the end. This is the Opiate EP. We're a few songs in. Um, I found a live performance from 1999, which is mixing it up a little bit because uh, the rest of the stuff's been like 1992, 1993. Um, so this is Tool, Jerk Off, Live, 1999, Remastered, whatever, whatever that means. All right, so let's get into it. That's a sick guitar riff. Also, the, the tone of the guitar sounds really good. And very nice drumming, as, as usual. Oh my god. <laughs> He's wearing... A, like a thong? Okay, that's got strange and slightly distracting, but I'm gonna look past that for now. That's a bold move. He can sing his ass off though, that's for sure. It's always intense and really powerful. It's a great riff. Like that's a super awesome riff. I can notice the audio quality on this one is significantly better than some of these other videos. Hmm, that little stop right there, that was cool. I haven't been paying attention to the lyrics really, but I can notice that there's some strong themes going on. <laughs> and can couple that with his outfit and you got quite the experience. <laughs> I love the groove in this though. Like the riffs are just perfect. Is that it? Nope. Oh, we're like halfway through. <laughs> God, their imagery is interesting as well. That's a unnerving imagery right there. I'm not sure how I, how I feel about that. <laughs> star sound effect going on. It's like a drone, um, like a sitar drone or something in the background. I wonder what like these, these concert goers, what kind of state of mind they're in. Do you drink before one of these shows? Do you smoke before one of these shows? Are you doing something else? Or are you sober? Man, it's pretty guitar. It's really pretty. I like this calm section here. drumming with the hi-hat, the hi -hat. It's subtle, and it's good. Where you expect a snare, there's like a hi-hat, sizzle instead. Now it's changed. But it's so sick. I mean, that's just beautiful. It's beautiful right there. It's like, this part's so like, 
so nice, and then you you look on the screen and you got a naked man in a thong. <laughs> And then you have this lyric going on. That's intense, though. Holy cow. This guy can sing his ass off. But he went from, like, pretty to, like, intense very quickly. I just don't understand how people scream like that while they sing. And again... That was nuts. <laughs> this guy is a character, man. I love his drumming, uh, the symbols that he has. Not the symbols, but like the, the design he has on his drums are sick. Wow, okay, that was a crazy experience with uh, everything going on visually there. But I have to say, if I'm just going to forget that part and be all about the music, that was one of my favorites from this this EP. Um, yeah, that's like one or two. Um, again, I'll do a ranking at the end, but that was one of my favorite ones, and I don't know what to say besides it had fantastic dynamics it was varied um everything from the drums to the riffs had a great um dynamics to them it would be groove in one way it would break off to a variation or a second part and then it would it had that whole break where the instrumentation was much more chill then his voice came in and his voice sounded pretty and it was kind of laid back and it had like kind of some meaning to it um in the, in the feeling of it, and then all of a sudden he just hits you with insanely powerful, like screaming, metal-esque vocals, and that was that was crazy. Um, but yeah, lots of nice little touches in that one, and um, I'm gonna keep on listening to and watching all these Tool uh, concert footage um, in order from first album to their newest stuff, so join me. Subscribe if you feel like it, and let's get going to the next one.